Welcome back to Trails of Cold Steel 4. Uh, should be video number 235 so far. So I apologize. I have to stop here because the video was getting too long. So for today's video, well, this will be a double upload for now for this recording session. Sorry about that. But next time uh, will be three or more if I have time because, you know, real life stuff. Trust me. Family is important in real life and other stuff. So uh, let's continue here. Um, have fun in Michelin before we the war and everything starts tomorrow man night's still young oh, trust me. got the whole park to ourselves too nice I mean thanks to McDowell and you know that reminds me why don't you give us performance Elliot yeah play more violins Let's do some music we got goosebumps from the last time I heard yeah the violin I even play. Wait a minute. Where did Yusus? Yeah, Yusus is with Milliam. I I didn't know Milliam can be right there because I thought you had to go near the sword to talk to Milliam. You know, I didn't know her spirit is like that far. Man, that's like again, it's the best gift that from uh, the Steel Maiden. I believe he went to go find Milliam earlier. Like he might do. This is their last night together, after all. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, hang around with these two. It's like George and Angelica are... Yeah, time alone themselves. Where's Toa? Huh. Quality guide time. But... Could be the... Yep, the night, you know. <laughs> Oh wow, you do have a point though. It's got me thinking, man. This guy talk, right? The guys here, a certain guy, has got more to think. On all of this combined, rather irritating when you put it that way. Rain, rain, of course. <laughs> uh, of course, you're the main uh, protagonist, you know, in this whole game, but. And you're the sacrifice. I mean, you're in the you're the main. You're the leader of the class seven. You're the you know everything, Green. You guys looking at me? You're the lady killer. You're the yeah. You know what I mean? A lot. Grats, Lloyd. You're not the most clueless guy in the room for once. We're nowhere near as bad as him. At least I have some self awareness. <laughs> Reen does have quite a few more options. It's easy for you to say. Lover boy. <laughs> what the? Ahem. In any case. Just as you said. There's maybe. Yeah. Our final night together. We gotta need plenty of rest too. I bet you have a ton of girls to confess. Their love to you. As it is already. Well. Yeah. Yeah. Reen. Any regrets? You should let a certain individual know how you feel, no matter uh, where those feelings may lie. <laughs> wow. You're right. I know what I have to do. Wait for your answer, sooner or later. Well, anyways, let's go enjoy whatever. Evening we got left. Between the beach and the park. Got the stores in the center open for us too. Nice. It's a lot of fun they had. That special gal. Had something he wanted. Oh, this is it. I want, he's going to teach him. He's going to master, you know, the. that's got to be it. Should go and see him when you get the chance. Oh, yes, I will see him. Sure thing. Have a good time out there. I mean, Rain was an intermediate, but now he go, goes master. Hell yeah. Rain's gonna master it. Well, oh, there they all go. There goes guys. There's Lloyd. Man, everyone. Um, finally. I've been trying to keep my role as the sacrifice out of my mind, but Crow was right. I don't want to end this with any regrets. Damn. 
You'll find the opportunity to speak with uh, Cassius. Yes, Cassius Bright. And with Balamar. Now, that'll be fine. You can finally uh, can again. Yeah. Three tickets? Come on. So then there's the tickets His Highness gave me. Yes, well. Oh, dear. So, yeah, this is where I'm going to do a lot of. Well, I'm going to save. And I'm going to do a lot of loading. You know, like what I did in the other bondings. Oh, there's got to be a lot. Oh, here it is. We even tied. Night of the Promises. I think this is a little bonus extra chapter, I guess. You know, just like, for example, when we rescue Reen in the. Uh, you know, in the, the gnome's hideout, I think. And then the real chapter begins, Act 4, right? Man, this is it. This is going to be a long one. To Wait, what? I thought we had three. What the? <laughs> okay, I'll just magically get two more. All right, thank you. What, whoever gave me the two tickets. So these special tickets can be used during the send-off party to participate in an attraction with a special companion of your choice. Yeah. I mean, just like in Trails of Cold Steel 3, right? In Michelin? Or... You can deepen bonds. I think it's true. So remember, a close bond with Mage... Ah, oh, yes. Yep. A special event. Yeah, that's what I was trying to say about that, you guys. The future. Oh! In the future. Okay, so, yeah. The companion you can invite changes depending on the attraction, so... Oh, man... I'll just see what I can do, because there's a lot, you know. You can progress the main storyline once you have used, oh, all five tickets and seen all major events. Okay, gotcha. Huh. A personal outfit? Yep, a lot of character notes. And there was also Vantage Masters? Am I getting closer to Vantage Masters? I probably missed a few again. Damn it. Just like in Trails of Cold Steel 3. So yeah, this is kind of like bonding a bit. Because I got five tickets. And I had to choose five. What the? Receptionist. So the five tickets. Ferris wheel, the three, and four, five. So, huh. I'm trying to think what to do. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to talk with everyone first, right? Well, no. I want to talk to Cassius Bright first. This is really important. I can't wait to see. I want to see it right now. And then after the major, uh, you know, with the red exclamation mark. And then uh, I'm going to talk to everyone, you know, to chat. And then after that, we're going to... Um, yeah, spend the tickets. And that's where I'm going to do the saving and loading. Or, you know, loading. A lot of loading. Just to see. Well, I don't know. We'll see what I can do. You know. Just like what I did in the third game in Michelin. Or, not Michelin, uh, Heimdall. Oh, my gosh. Oh, hey. That's... Yeah, that's uh, Yun, uh, Matthew. Uh, Yuna's father. Yeah, thanks. Yep. About it, we have Yeah, because you know most of the visitors are all like families and, but mostly like soldiers with their uh, you know the man, and then they all go to the war. <laughs> yep, that's him, Prince Oliver. And this has a lot of connections. Yeah, he is. One of the legendary heroes, man, I would put on my list. Does indeed. He's a legendary hero. I mean, he's been also in Trails from Zero, Sky, and the other games. You know, just to visit around and... Man, he's like, want to travel all around the world. Alright. So, well, let's see. I'm just going to take a peek. Uh, I went the wrong way. Damn it. Who's the card? Man, there's so many people to talk to. What the? Toval. Well, uh, 
Oh my god, there's so much to do! There's so much to do! So yeah, I gotta stick to the plan. So I'm gonna go to the... <laughs> I'm pretty excited. Man, l lots of stuff to do. More videos. Huh. It's an extra event. There's a sub event. Key event. And of course, Annabelle. Uh, I hope this is it. So I get the final fish. So hold up on. Huh. Okay. So what I'm gonna... Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, I forgot it's Linde. Oh my god. They're not holding hands? Come on. Come on. <laughs> nah, it's joking, guys. Hey, it's Rainier, right? Rainier? No, it's Rains. Oh, my bad. I got confused between Rains and Ra Rainier. The, you know, the other guy. What the? Oh my gosh. Valamar, man. Alright, so I'm gonna... What I'm gonna do... Yeah. The red exclamation mark for the key events first. And then uh, after that, I'm gonna go around and talk to everyone, sub events and everything. And then the cards will be last. So yeah. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna save right now. Uh, I'm, I need to do something, so I'll be right back. Alright, no. I am back. Oh, thank you, Reen. I am back, so sorry about that. I had to uh, fix some stuff real quick. Got plenty of time, 23 minutes. So this is gonna be a lot of videos uh, for this uh, Michelin bonding and everything. Because this is very nice. Um, well, let's keep going. Let's chat with Valimar. Man, it's been a long time, Valimar. Man, he looks so different now. Well, because we got, you know, Rutger's power and, you know. Yes, let's chat. As well, Reen. Where's the sword? Oh, this is so freaking awesome. Huh. The cusp of the Great Twilight may soon be upon us. But this evening is still as lovely as ever. Yep. Really is. Now that you mention it, we had an evening just like this two years back. Huh. Oh my god. Just thinking exactly the same. Man. Yep, you're back to your old self again. And you got upgraded. It's too bad we didn't get the wings, so... I'm just sorry that I couldn't do anything to help. Yeah, but... Yeah, don't worry. My past Awakeners have all experienced their share of agony and hesitation. But each of them continued to persevere in spite of it. Oh, well, different than they... I guess, but wait. So what you when you say past awakeners, yeah, Emperor Dracos, right? Was he like me too? Yeah, because Emperor Dracos was the previous pilot of Valimar, you know, and then now Reen. Huh, naturally so. I have finally managed to recover the whole. Oh, finally, man! Because it's been so long since Trails of Cold Steel one and a little bit of one because we just unlocked him. And then he's trying to get his memory uh, at Trails of Cold Steel 2. Because it takes a long time. Man, and finally he got all of his memories. So though because I fell to sleep not long after the War of the Lions, uh, the Dracos, I remember, was only a prince. Holy cow. Oh man, it is both amusing to learn that the hopeless optimist I once knew is today praised as father of the renaissance damn bet it is what do you think of him now then uh osborne i mean the reason why i if you watched my previous video you saw that thing uh, i bump up rufus over uh you know osborne i mean I still like a few things about Osborne, you know, like he did save Reen's life, but you know, he had he had no choice. He had to accept that dumb curse, unfortunately, because of Shmelga, and he had to transfer his heart to Reen. Um, another thing I like, for example, about Osborne is that he tells uh, Lecter and, you know, like nobody invades Roar. I mean, that's another thing, because if anyone tries to invade Roar, and then yeah. If you watch that um, bonding with Altina, um, 
another thing like you know he invites everyone in for some reason in Heimdall and at least he's telling Reen the truth and all but man but unfortunately this curse gotten worse and man he's soon gonna get corrupted and I don't know if we can save him man I mean and plus he's a mortal man and I forgot some other things he did good, but, you know, lots of stuff happening. There's a lot of bad things he did that I didn't like about Osborne. Like, for example, like the Liberation Front. Wait, but the co color of his soul remains the same. I sense no trace of him being... Huh. Man, well, that was back then, right? Or, wait, I see. So, thanks, Valimar. I think I'm ready to face him no matter how they okay so he wasn't fully controlled or yet by Ishmelga because Ishmelga I'd say Ishmelga is the 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 more um he's the main uh antagonist of this whole series he's the reason why he caused everything all this shit man that sucks that's why I put Ishmelga at number one and then number two is uh Black Albrecht because I hate him I do this. And I hate Rufus as number three because he killed, um, you know, Vita's bird. I forgot the name. And plus, uh, the Steel Maiden. What a jerk. Freaking Rufus. I don't care if he dies. I don't care. Well, yeah, I don't know about Usus, but, you know, what he would react, but. Yep, you've been growing a lot. So sorry about that, you guys. All that, uh,. Commentary, but you know, that's not what I was thinking because you know, this is a, a blind let's play a, a commentary Because yeah, I'm enjoying this. I, I've been learning this a lot as much as I can trying to understand through this whole series and Can't wait to go back a bit, you know trails from zero and see what happens before My power is yours Acknowledge anything else hey, Where's the sword? Wait, did Ordeen already go back to the crates? Wait, what? I, I saw Ordeen next to you before, on that cutscene. He decided to con... Oh, scout the area, just say- Oh yeah, I see. So they're just taking turns, I bet, while Valimar, you know, just resting. I plan to relieve him of his patrol- Yeah, yep. So he'll be next soon. Appreciate it. Give him my thanks as well, okay. So yeah, they're patrolling around the barrier, just in case if there's any- Suspicious activity near the barrier, I guess, so. Oh, wow. Yep, there's Crossbell right over there. Because I see Orcus Tower over there. Yeah. Man, this is awesome. Uh, Yeah, about Osborne, there's one... There's, like, a lot of things I didn't like about him. Like, what he did. Like, for example, like... You know, Crow's grandfather. Like, what... You know, building a rail over, you know, especially the Liberation Front members. I mean, they all hated Osborne. Well, so, my bad, you guys. It really is beautiful. Man, these two can... Why, can't they do something else besides fishing? And my bad. I think I accidentally, uh, you know, triggered this cutscene, but I didn't know. I think like a few good casts on this summer night, huh? Man, it's so beautiful. Look at all the stars. Just like we looked up in Nord Highlands in the first game. Annabelle, I wanted to thank you. Stick with me all the Yeah, because Annabelle was looking all over for you, Kenneth. But, you know, Kenneth was one of the um, people that, you know, keep it a secret for the Courageous too. He's been gone for a while. Helping you because I want to. You don't need to worry about me. Oh, guess you're right. Do something. Uh oh. What do I have to do as a gra graduate of Thor's. Even my life. I'm trying to say it is. This might be the last time we meet. Uh oh. I'm sorry. We've been through so much together. Oh, this war will stay. Yeah, we need to go back home where it's safe. First things tomorrow morning. Yeah. And plus her butler, um, I forgot his name, my bad. He's been he's so worried about her. That's why he made a phone call in the uh, Ursula's hospital. So that's but you, Kenneth. I can't. What? 
Huh? She wants to be with him, Kenneth. Uh-oh. Hey, I'm not going to say goodbye to you, Kenneth. I won't. I'll stick with you. This... Didn't stick with you all this time. Just to wish you a nice... Wait, what? <laughs> I know I was just there. Or just here for the ride at the start. I don't have the same strong convictions you have. Here's what I am going to say. Something I've never had the heart to before. I can't just follow behind you forever. I get that. So just promise me this, Kenneth. Promise me to come home safely because... Come on, say it! What are you going to say? <laughs> come on! Because how else could we go on a cross-continent fishing trip together? What? That's it? <laughs> All these two care is fishing, 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 fishing. Like, you know, together, I mean. Uh, <laughs> blushing. You messed it up. We're supposed to tell him how you feel. Yes, how you feel. Wow. Well, more eavesdropping. <laughs> I'm not sure I should be spying on this uh, tender moment. <laughs> Oh, I guess she didn't quite hit the market. Well, I guess not yet anyway. Oh, I thought this is it! Oh, wow. Man, it's so beautiful. There's the... Wait. Yeah, that's the pantagruel, right? Yeah. And there's the courageous too. Huh. Where's the Markaba? I mean, they parked near... Oh, there's the... Yep. Or, you know, the Kapoa. Okay, anyways, how much time do I got left? 13 minutes. My bad, you guys. Uh, uh, oh, shoot, there's so much stuff to do. I'll get back to the docks, so my bad. Oh, shoot, do I have time for this? The restaurant? I really want to see this. Uh, you know, Cassius Bright. I mean, yeah, Bright. Oh, man. Where is he? Where is he? Oh, yeah, this is the rep. Man, look at him. Everyone, like, and this is so awesome, all the characters. There he is. Oh my gosh, he's sitting right next with the Radiant Blade Master. Oh my god, these guys are badasses. Let's do it now, I apologize. This might be a little long video. There you are. Thanks for coming. Joshua filled me in on the details. Oh yeah, just to let you guys know, I also save on a different slot, just in case. So, I heard you two knew each other from before. Guild Braid four years ago, huh? Yeah, Master Kafai had told me a much about Cassius as well. So we became friends in no time. After that, I introduced you and Arios. That duel, you two have go down in history as one of the greatest feats of swordsmanship in Zumerian history. Wow. Huh. Staff, man. Seem like they're an entire different league as far as skill. Goes for the Divine Blade and win included. Damn. About that discussion I mentioned. Right, it's just begun, so feel free to enjoy yourself. A little. Okay. This matter might be a bit complicated. <laughs> Highness gave you some tickets, did he not? This is your night. Spend it wisely. Yeah, with, uh, what's her name? Laura, huh? <laughs> I must admit, I, I, I am a little curious about who you would invite to join. Yeah, I was thinking of Laura. <laughs> huh? Okay, you should come back and speak to Lieutenant General Cassius after... Using three of your... Ah, oh, Come on! I thought it was the thing, like, he's gonna teach Reen the master, uh, you know. I guess not yet. So we gotta spend three tickets and then come back here. Oh, bummer. Okay, anyways, uh, back to the wharf. My bad, you guys. Because I gotta check everything, talk to everyone, see how they doing, you know. And then, uh, yeah. The tickets. The tickets! Oh, I'm just gonna ignore some of these extra like this. Well, uh, forget it. I'll just chat. Everyone, I'm just by myself. Huh. Beautiful skyline of Crossbell. Man, I like this. This Michelum. This is like by far the best. 
I mean, compared to Trials of Cold Steel 1, like the bonding, you know, the school festival and, you know, and Trials of Cold Steel... I forgot about number two, it's been a long time. Number three is in Heimdall, and then number four is in uh, Michelum. Holy cow. I guess a Looming War will do that, huh? Huh. Alright. So, why there's a extra event on this cat? I thought you were Celine, but never mind. Wait, Elizabeth. Uh, there's a cat here. Yeah, are you hungry? Uh, I guess he is. Yep. Should be a fishing spot nearby. Wait. What do we say we try and catch you something to eat? Huh. Wait a minute. I don't know. Here, you can have a uh, rainbow trout? I don't know. Oh! Thank you! Now I got six! What the? This is your little way of saying thanks, maybe. Well, in that case, I humbly accept. Thank you! Huh. Oh, I don't know, like, did you just give her, give him a fish? Elizabeth a fish? Any kind of fish, right? Or do I have to give him a specific fish? I don't know. Oh well, we got a ticket anyways. Man, imagine if you don't have, uh, well, the, now I see why there's a fishing spot there, but... And I remember, I forgot, like, last time when I was first here in Michelum, Yeah, I forgot to, I don't have, like, fishing bait. Whoops. But this time I have... Hmm. This looks like a good spot to cast along. Yeah, yeah. Let's fish right now. There! I just need one fish! Got a bite! So is this it? <laughs> nice. Nope. You're not the legendary fish. I think I need to talk to someone, a certain NPC, not to unlock it. Because I did catch all... Yeah, see? You can see I have 29 out of 30. And I did got the trophy fishing in the first game and third game, just to remind you guys of that again. And maybe the fourth game, but... Yeah, maybe I gotta talk to someone. Maybe the legendary fish is here. Or somewhere. I don't know. Okay, let's chat with these two. I got plenty of time a little bit. Seven minutes. <laughs> Continent-wide fishing tour. Or basically, they're gonna go all, all around the world anyways. I mean, they love fishing. They'll work hard to make it reality. It's going to be a ton of fun. That's great. <laughs> no, it's not! <laughs> this is all wrong. I guess I should be grateful. Wants to come on the strip, but still, come on. I can feel Annabelle's distress in your eyes. Hope these two can figure things out. Man, I don't know how long, but whatever. Damn. Such a pity. Still a trip with Kenneth. Just thought has me expected. Man, they'll be like so old by now when after they traveled all around and around the world, you know, in Zumeria and I mean these two will be standing like I don't know. Chat. Hmm. Huh. You sure do like this, huh, Reen? Well, at least he has fishing baits I can buy. Yeah, I just need one more fish. Oh, wow. Um, I hope we meet that certain someone, but, you know, I'll sell it a little Tight bit later. Lines out there. You sure do like this, huh, Reen? <laughs> His voice. Uh. Man, I wish I need more of this, but Tight okay. lines out there. Yeah. And you say the same thing. All right. Uh who else? So, oh yeah. Let's talk with Gaius and uh Linde. I see a perfect couple here. Why are you not two holding hands, huh? Oh. Check out the jetty. Felt like I needed to cool down a little. Get to do the same. They ran into each other a little while ago. Oh! The city looks so beautiful at night. I used to love looking at all the lights. I worked at Sears a Hospital. Oh. 
Crossbell, your second home. I feel a little... Yeah, because Gaius, I mean, he'd been saying back then, like, you know, um, Nord Highlands is his first home. And then now Erebonia, you know, is his second home, you know. The wind brings back memories of Nord. Yeah, Nord Highlands. It feels familiar somehow. Huh. Challenge that we place to protect every place ever called home. Oh, okay. Now I'm really con <laughs> confused. So I guess I'm a dating now. Oh, yes, they are. Are they just really good friends? Oh, he's still with us, Reen. Oh, uh, sorry, I didn't mean to space out. Either way, it's none of my business. <laughs> have two homes I'll ha lay everything on the line tomorrow for both my family afar and my friends right here yeah hopefully they're safe because yeah there is a spire um one of the spires uh, around near uh, you know Nord Highland so hopefully they're okay man oh wow huh all right, sorry about that. I'm back. Sorry, I'm just checking my timer. I thought I screwed up, but I got like around three minutes. All right, that's the wharf done. Now next up, yep, the Michelin Center. So again, I'm gonna try to talk to everyone and check out these events because I could get extra tickets and stuff like that, you know. Wait, so I have, okay, so I can go twice in one of them, right? Okay. Yeah. Oh, wait. Yeah, one, two, three, five, six. Because I got six tickets. So, uh, okay. Let's talk with the these two. And then I'm going to end the video. Sorry about that. Huh. Well, he's sparkling right now. This place is amazing. Actually, that's... Yeah, I don't know where to start either. <laughs> I was just trying to, you know, go around and talk to everyone. Or coaster with me. There's like so much to do and talk to everyone. If it's under the army's nose, is black and white. Chops that lately. I say we deserve some coaster rolling, uh, ghost snipping stresses. <laughs> Man. I think the Ferris wheel is still by far the best, I think, in Michelin. Alright, so sorry about that, you guys, because uh, I have to uh, do something real quick. But, you know, it's a double upload. I'm pretty uh, busy for, at the moment. So, this is Ray on Trails of Cold Steel 4. Um, next time, uh, yeah, we're going to talk to everyone here. And then we're going to do Vantage Masters and check out the sub-event. Yeah, I think. And then more, like, you know, chat with everyone in Michelin. So thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Hopefully you guys enjoy this double upload and goodbye, Reen. Okay. And everyone around.